Showdown Fights, live from the UCCU Center on the campus of Utah Valley University in Orm, Utah. The closer that I get to the cage, the stronger that I feel. I turn around and I walk in the cage, and when I walk into the cage, you know, I touch the cage and I feel it and find my footing, find my balance, and then I turn and I look and I find my opponent, and I feel invincible. And that's why I fight, is, is for that moment. The Dust, the People's Warrior, I see the fight starting with us touching gloves in the middle, me pressing forward, me putting him up against the cage, and just really taking advantage of him finding his weaknesses and making him wish he never stepped in there and signed that contract to fight Jamie Yeager, AKA the chosen one. Yeager's coming into this fight with confidence. He's uh, had four wins in a row. You know, he thinks that he's gonna come in here and just take me out, what he said in his interview. And I think that, you know, if you watch any of my fights, that's never happened. He needs to know that he's in for a war, that I'm not going anywhere, and I never back up in any of my fights. So I'll be right there in front of him the whole time. You better be ready for that. I plan to extend my four fight win streak to a five fight win streak and uh, continue my path back to the UFC. We're both just going into this fight trying to get back to the UFC and I think that that's what fuels this fight and makes it such an intense fight, you know, is that we've both been there and now we're both trying to get back there. And Jaeger's standing in my way of getting there. Is there bad blood between Josh Berkman and I? I really don't care. All I'm cared about is getting back to the UFC, and he's standing in front of me, so um, I gotta take him out. Jaeger isn't what fuels me to fight. You know, Jaeger's not the reason that I'm stepping into the cage. It doesn't matter to me what Jaeger says, what he does, because when we get into the cage together and the referee says get out of the way, he's gonna try to beat me up, and I'm gonna try to beat him up. So there's gonna be big shots thrown, and there's gonna be, it's gonna be a very aggressive fight, because I don't see either of us backing up. Josh Berkman, if you get a chance to see this, it doesn't matter what you do, you're going down. Jaeger says he's gonna come in and he's gonna run through me, you know, but you know, you guys got the clips. Brandon Melendez said he did the same thing. <laughs> Kofi ran his mouth, said he was gonna beat me up, and look what happened. Every fight, you know, you can say what you want to say, but when you get into the cage, you're a you know, you're responsible for the words that come out of your mouth and I'm gonna make him pay just like I did Melendez, just like I did Kofi.